there come the dogs. Um, in any case, so there's another project I want to get done. Hello, babies. I feel slightly ignored. And that, uh, that is the uh, preparation of the chainsaw, because uh, for transport, it needed to be uh, drained. Now, not of the chain oil, and I'm gonna explain that in a second, but there is no um, gasoline in this, and this is gasoline and oil mixture. So, I've got that ready for, because we have other uh, things that need that too. Um, but let me see, we are getting this ready now because we are going to uh, cut back uh, certain things like the base of the really old linden trees or lime trees um, because they, uh, these risers there take the, uh, the energy out of the, the tree. So you want to keep them short and remove them. And I have some other small uh, trees that need to go. And in addition to that, uh, we have some dead trees that just came down. Uh, nothing big uh, in a very manageable height. So I'm actually really excited. I love my chainsaw. And uh, this is not sponsored, unfortunately. Uh, we don't get any uh, bonus points here from uh, the company that we're using. And noodle that. So this is chain oil. So the when you cut, you need to make sure that the uh, chain is always oiled so it runs smoothly. And that is always really important. You will notice the difference if you for a while forget to uh, add chain oil and then you put it in. It's amazing how much faster you actually cut. So in any case, that is all for tomorrow. And I uh, will show you, oh, hopefully, if it's not pouring rain, uh, show you how much we can get accomplished with this in a couple of hours.
So this is all going to be partially firewood, but um, the younger risers we're going to clean up and use as sticks in the garden for wet vegetables. So this is all hazelnut risers. Um, these are very thick, they're flexible, and so we can use them in, in the vegetable garden. This would have cost us about 200 euros, almost same in dollars, to buy all of this at a garden center. So, um, and 100, 200 years ago, there were no garden centers. This is what I've learned from my grandparents, great-grandparents. That's what they used at the farm. So. Uh, it's a much smarter way to um, reuse things that are actually completely uh, have no carbon print whatsoever.